हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सुरेश अग्रवाल्स मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्टकट्स व्हेन यू ऐड नंबर्स समटाइम्स यू मेक एरर्स आल्सो एंड एवरीबॉडी डज राइट बट व्हाट इज द रेमेडी डू यू हैव टू ऐड ऑल द नंबर्स अगेन और यू हैव सम मेथड्स थ्रू व्हिच यू कैन चेक क्विकली चेक whether your numbers have been added correctly or not vedic maths has an answer to this and this is what i am going to discuss in this amazing video which is a part of our chapter number 1 of the ebook of short tricks for quantitative aptitude that is add and subtract 10x faster that is the chapter name and this is regarding checking the accuracy of addition so when you add many numbers of like three digit four digit even five digit numbers you know that is a skill and you want to check it check the answer whether it is correct or not not by redoing the entire thing this method will help you and let me tell you about the concept involved in the trick first now you must all have heard about the digit sum that means what is the sum of the digits and what is a single digit for all numbers now when we talk about digit sum in hindi or in vedic maths we call it bijank that bijank or single digit for every number is the concept of this trick let's understand that suppose you have a number like 83 now when you add the digits of 83 you get 8 plus 3 11 Eleven happens to be a two-digit number again. So do the same thing again. One plus one, that gives you a single-digit number. So this two is the bijank or the digit sum of this two-digit number eighty-three. Likewise, you can find the single digit for every number, whether it is three-digit, four-digit, five-digit, and so on. Now there is a very interesting thing here. Suppose the number is seven hundred. And twenty-eight. Now, instead of adding all the digits, what you can do here is, you have a short trick for the short trick. All the digits which add up to nine, like seven and two, they add up to nine. You can just omit them, and you are left with the single digit, which will be the single digit of the complete number seven hundred and twenty-eight. You can check it. Seven plus two, nine. Nine plus eight is seventeen. And one plus seven is again eight. So all digits which add up to nine actually can be omitted, and you will get the same single digit again. So nines can be omitted. That is very important, uh, which forms, uh, you know, like seventy percent of the concept of this trick. Here you can see all these digits: seven, six, five, three, four, eight, two, eight, six. we have some digits which add up to 9 so we can actually omit those digits directly here you can see a 5 and a 4 they add up to 9 a 6 and a 3 they add up to 9 see i am using different numbers to find the pairs of nines it can be like three different digits adding up to 9 that that all depends on you know how quickly you can find the pairs and omit them now apart from that i can't see any more uh, nines or do we have like oh yeah 7 and 2 that again forms a 9 and now we have a 8 8 and a 6 so 8 plus 8 plus 6 is 16 plus 6 22 and 22 means 2 plus 2 4 and that means of all these numbers which are being added the single digit number comes out to be 4 and what happens here in the answer we have a 9 we have a 9 i told you all the nines can be omitted so we have 1 and 3 and 1 plus 3 it adds up to 4 again and since the single digit number of all the numbers being added and the sum it is same there is a great chance that your addition is correct so this is the concept of the trick and now we can try some of these questions let us check the accuracy of this Now see how quickly we can do that. Instead of writing like thirty-four and fifty-nine one below the other, and then writing ninety-three as the sum, we don't need to do all these things. Among all these numbers on the left-hand side, are there any nines? Yes, there is a nine. 
there is a 4 and a 5 and what remains is 3. That means 3 is the digit sum of all the digits on the left hand side and on the right hand side I have the 9 and I have 3 again and therefore this addition is correct. Likewise, now see how quickly I did it without actually having to add the numbers. Likewise, I can do it for this also. On the left hand side, I have all these digits 5, 3, 4, 2, 8. So are there any 9's here? Let us look for them. 5 plus 4 is 9 and rest of them are not giving me a 9. 3, 2 and 8. So I'll have to add them. So 3 plus 2 plus 8 gives me 13 and 13 again is a two digit number. So 1 plus 3 gives me a 4. So the left hand side gives me the single digit 4. Let's check the right hand side. No 9's here. So 5 plus 6 plus 2 that is 11 plus 2 13 and 13 means 1 plus 3 equal to 4. Single digit numbers are same and therefore the addition is correct. Likewise, let's check this. Do we have 9's here? Yes, I can see some 9's. A 9 direct 9 here and a 5 plus 4 9 here. So I am left with 8, 7 and 5 which do not form 9. So 8 plus 7 plus 5 that gives me 15 plus 5 20 and 20 means 2 plus 0 2. So the single digit on the left hand side is 2. On the right hand side 9 cancels out. So it is 1 1 1 which gives me 1 plus 1 plus 1 3. So the single digit number on the left hand side and the right hand side do not match and therefore the addition is wrong. So you can pick up the calculators and check 857 plus 954 is not going to give me 1911. Likewise here we have a 4 digit number and another 4 digit number being added. So let's cancel the 9's. A 7 and a 2. A 3 and a 3 and a 3. See 3 digits. And then a 9 directly. So 4 plus 4 is 8. So single digit number on the left hand side is 8. How about the right hand side? 6 plus 3 9. 1 0 7 1 plus 0 plus 7 is again 8. And so the addition seems to be correct. We can check some more. Look at this. We have 3 numbers being added. And the result here is 6 and 3 9. We can cancel out directly. So 1 plus 2 plus 2. The right hand side digit is 5. On the left hand side, we have some things being cancelled. 9 cancels out. Uh, what about 5 and 4? It cancels out. 3 plus 3 plus 3 cancels out. Uh, do we have any other 9s uh, being formed? I don't think so. So let's add 8 plus 4 plus 3 here and a 4 here plus 4. So this is 8 plus 4, 12, 12 plus 7, this is 19 and 19 means 1 plus 9, 10 and 10 means 1 plus 0, 1 and look at this, the left hand side has single digit 1 and the right hand side has single digit 5, therefore our addition, that means the answer which we have obtained is incorrect. So this is how you become smarter friends. This is how you save time in the exams. You know, you can't redo all the calculations and check all of them again and again. So you need to have some uh, short tricks, some Vedic maths uh, smart tricks, which you can adopt in these exams. So friends, if you like this video, do subscribe to our YouTube channel. I hope you have clicked, clicked the bell shaped icon and you must be getting all the notifications of all the uploads which we are doing on this amazing channel Suresh Agarwal's Mathematics Shortcuts. Do like this video and as soon as you click the like button you will find the option to hide the video which is a very important feature so that the video comes in the feed of other students also who are aspiring to calculate 10 times faster. So friends do practice this and I'm sure this is going to help a great deal in understanding addition and getting the correct answer in the first attempt. All the best.